This is chapter number four, the making of a global world. We are taking the MCQs or multiple choice questions. First is people, livelihood and local economy of which of the following was badly, means countries we have to find out, was badly affected by the disease name Rinderpest. The answer is Africa. Because this Rinderpest, it killed almost 90% of the, you can say, animals who belong to Africa and who belong to the African people. Which were, which were the most important, uh, you can say, livelihood or because they don't work. African people, they were not working at that time. They don't know payment, etc. Salaries, they doesn't know. They are only dependent on their stock, livestock. And these livestock were badly hurt by Rinderpest. Which of the following powerful weapons were used by the Spanish conquerors to colonize America during mid-17th century? The answer is biological weapons. It's the pox. That is, we call it as chechak. So this was the small pox, which was a biological weapon they used. Why did the wheat price fall down by 50% between 1928 and 1934? The answer here is due to Great Depression or you can say economic slowdown. Most Indian indentured workers came from, the answer is A, Eastern Uttar Pradesh, who adopted the concept of assembly line to produce automobiles. He was Henry Ford. He actually got this idea from the, uh, the chicken, you know, where they are killed, the chicken, and there was an assembly line. And he got that idea from there. In ancient period, the cowries, cowry we call as, were used as what? It's a currency. Cowry, this cowry belonged to Maldives. So, these are just shells, you know, shells that are found in the shores of Maldives and that are used as cowries. Which of the following disease killed the majority of America original inhabitants? And the answer is smallpox as we just saw in previous question. It's smallpox because these people were not immune to this disease. That is why they just died. In which place of India were the canal colonies or canal colonies? Canal uh, or canal is the Nehar waterways, small waterways, colonies set up. The answer here is Punjab. The place, this Punjab, this area we were talking about is half desert area. So because of this canal, the wheat was grown and it was grown in order to export it. The first spreading disease of cattle plague is known as ninth. The answer is Rinderpest. Which of the following place was an important destination for indentured migrants? And the answer here is Caribbean island. The Trinidad, Guyana like this. At which of the following states in USA was the United National Nations Monetary and Financial Conference held in 1944. The answer is New Hampshire. There was a hotel there and uh, Bretton Woods, that, that is called the place, there was a hotel where this was organized. Which two institutions were non, well known as Bretton Wood Institution? The answer here is IMF and World Bank. Twelve. C is the answer. Who introduced the assembly line method for producing automobiles on a large scale? The answer here is again Henry Ford. He created such business or such use of the assembly line that in three minutes 
he was able to produce one vehicle one uh, car newly irrigated areas to settle peasants of punjab were known as canal or canal colonies the group of powers collectively known as the axis power during the second world war were see there were two two parties which were in fight in pursuit axis power and the allies so 15 the answer is germany italy and japan this is second world war we are talking about who among the following is a nobel prize winner v s naipaul this is he belonged to the caribbean islands and as the name suggest his forefathers might have been the indentured laborers from india which of the following combination correctly indicates the three flows of international economic exchange the answer here is goods labor and capital next one is which of the following statement correctly identifies the corn laws it was restricted that is the corn was restricted to be imported to england so answer is a which of the following refers to el dorado the answer is the fable city of gold el dorado the fable city of gold next is until 18th century which two countries were considered the richest in the world and it was of course india and china which of the following reflects the culture fusion between india and trinidad the answer here is chutney music you can you know see the beats of the uttar you can say uttar pradesh and nearby area the music you can hear the flavor of this music in this chutney music transport of perishable goods over long distance was possible because of refrigeration refrigerated ships the ships having a possibility of refrigeration so that the perishable goods like the meat can be sent over long distance which of the following sustained the african lives for centuries the answer here is land and the livestock livestock the animals they reared they get the milk cheese curd from them and of of course meat in trinidad what was referred as jose jose the answer is annual muharram this is a muslim uh, you can say mostly shia the uh, shia festivity is this one but it's not a festivity because uh, they mourn for someone they mourn from hazrat ali so annual muharram procession may marking a carnival jose what is meant by tariff the answer here is tax imposed on countries import from the rest of the world that is tariff levied the world bank was set up to the answer here is finance post war construction post war construction because there was war and after war all the countries were in not in were not in a position to stand up themselves they need some reconstruction agency next mark the correct response out of the following the answer here is the silk road acted as a link between different countries correct the silk road helped in cultural and commercial exchange correct the silk road acted as a route for west bound silk cargoes from china correct so our answer will be all of the above why was the 19th century indenture described as a system of slavery you have to mark the most suitable statement the answer here is the indentured labor did not have any rights and lived like slaves because the contract between them everything is not disclosed they are just shown the positive side and when they reach there they are confronted with all the bad things the bad things that have not been uh, intimated to them why did the export of fine indian textile to england decline 
in 19th century. The answer here, here is its British government imposed heavy tariff on import of cotton textile. Next, which of the following resulted in Britain trade surplus? The answer here is British export to India was much higher than British imports from India. That is why it resulted in Britain's trade surplus. Which of the following factor compelled the Africans to work for wages? And this, uh, this was of course the, the disease which killed a lot of or almost 90% of the livestock on which these Africans were dependent. So this is loss of livestock. Which of the following is the most important cause of Great Depression? As I said, economic slowdown. The answer is agricultural overproduction leading to fall of prices in agricultural goods. Why were the Europeans attracted most to Africa? You know, anything which gave them uh, the material, the resources, the land, they're happy. So, answer here is for the vast land resources and mineral wealth. Which of the following enabled the Europeans to conquer and control the Africans? The answer is control over the scarce resource of cattle. That is, because of the render pest, render pest around 90% of the cattle or livestock already died. 10% were remaining. So they just got control over this 10%. That is how they conquered. Which of the following is the direct effect? Of Great Depression on Indian trade? The answer is Indian exports and imports nearly halved between 1928 to 1934. If I can give you some number, it was around 107 to 52, or you can say 100 to 52, it went down. 50, it went down, almost halved. So, this is the key to all the questions we just covered. Thank you so much and take care of yourself.